Okay, I'm back, babes. So, this video is going to be all over the place. I started the video out on one device. That device has since said that my memory is gone. Then I started it on the camera, and the camera has stopped blinking and carrying it on as well. And now I'm on my other device. So, in this video, I have applied my lashes, chit-chatted a little bit, you know, the things and all that, but I'm in the process of tinting my brows. So, I was showing you guys that, and I hope I can piece this video together. If not, it's going to be broken down in shorts, unfortunately. But this is the thing that I'm using. It is the Brow Buddy, and it looks sort of like this. It allows you to map your brows out. Of course, you map them in the middle, then for the arches, and then for the ends. So I've got mine all mapped out, and I'm just in the process now of, okay, yeah, this goes in here. Now of filling them in with my tint, the tint that I am using, one second. And I got I get my tint from Beat Hive, and that's B E A T dot h i v e hive beat hive and these are the ones that i have right here i have two different colors so i have um and forgive me if i can't see but those are the two colors that i have oh wait yeah pull it around a little bit and i also have the remover so just in case I have to go in and clean up anything, I have that remover. So I just put a little bit down on my makeshift palette. And I'm just placing that all in that area. Um, avoiding the front, of course, because we're going to go for an ombre type of look. So I'm just going to go ahead and keep filling in. I've already put one layer, so I'm going to probably go in for about three layers, if not more than that, because I want this to be dark. I like dark brows. Don't judge me. Judge your mammy. Mm-hmm. I said it. So if you don't like dark brows, mm, I don't care. Don't tell me about it, because you, some of y'all can be quite opinionated. I mean, for the most part, everybody is pretty much respectful and gives great suggestions. But I have recently gotten a couple, oh, oh you're a man. I couldn't tell if you had hair on your lip. Like, come on, you really dragging it. There is no hair on my lip, not any, not even fine hairs. So you must be looking at your own damn top lip or your mammy's lip when you're talking about mine. But I got all that said for really nothing because I don't care about the trolls. I really, really don't. It's just, it's... It's kind of sad though, when you think about it, um, that first of all, and most of the people that's doing it, they don't even have like pictures Oh, that's a low battery. I'm going to have to put this on the battery. Freak. Um, they don't even have a picture for their thumbnail or their logo or um, what do you call that thing in the front? Anyway, they'll have a picture. So you look real cute criticizing somebody else and you don't even have a damn picture put up. I mean, this is it. This is what you get. What you see is what you get. So if you got negative things to say, I would prefer you just come face to face and say it as far as don't throw a rock and hide your hand. Get me? I mean, it's not like, what am I going to do? Beat you up? Threaten you? I can do no more than I can to keep you from posting negative stuff to begin with. But at the same time, if you're going to be disrespectful to that level, I really would like to see who's doing all the disrespecting. 
probably some troll on the internet, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and finish this up and I'll get back on camera. All right, guys, so I have gotten the pattern all laid, the mapping, I'm sorry. And then you see I have gone in with the actual tint. Again, these are the two that I'm using. And if I didn't mention before, I know I got cut off, but it's Beat Hive is the young lady's name. That's her um, beauty page on Instagram. And she sells these. Um, directly from her site like I said I have two different colors and then I have the clear or the remover I'm sorry I don't know one is supposed to be dark one is supposed to be a little bit lighter but I just mix them all together as to not have them too too dark and then of course I do want them to show up so typically I just add a, like a little pea size drop to each I don't know why that's okay. So I'm gonna let this dry and then I'm gonna put another layer on.